Hey guys, welcome to our channel. In today's video, is we're gonna learn about how to use OBS virtual camera on OMI TV. So as you can see, we have already set up the OBS studio or virtual camera on our OMI TV in here. And for you to be able to get started as well, to have your OBS studio like this. So this is a step-by-step -step guide for you. So the things to consider or the things that you need to have onto your device are these things. So you need to have OBS Studio installed first, so you could search OBS Studio onto your local browser and then download it and also the certain file in here, which is the OBS Cam Registry Fixer. So you need to have this file so that you could download or use it onto your OMI TV. Then right after, once you have this file already, you need to extract this first and once you have extracted this, you'll just need to open this file. So onto this file in here, you could see these two things. So you need to run this first. Right after you've run it, you should be able to see this message in here. So you should do this thing onto both of this one in here. So right after you've done that, so the next thing that you need to do is to head onto your device manager. Here on the device manager, you need to head onto the camera and disable the current camera that you have onto your device. So this one, so you'll just need to right click onto this and you need to disable this if it is still able onto your device. So right after that, you need to head onto the settings of your browser. Here on the settings, head onto privacy and security and then click onto site settings. Then you need to find the permissions in here and then click onto camera. So as you can see, we have this HD webcam C252. So you need to have this or click onto this since this is the camera that is set for your OBS studio. So just click onto this and then that's just basically it and you should be able to see the OBS studio set up onto your device. So onto your OBS studio, don't forget also to start the virtual camera in there or this certain button. So right after you click onto that, it should be enabled already and it should be running onto your OMI TV. And that's just basically it onto using OBS virtual camera on OMI TV. And if you think this has been helpful, don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and we'll see you on to our next video.